the best wide receiver in the National Football League, Devontae Adams. We are underreacting to this situation. Here's what he had to say. Here's what the best wide receiver in the National Football League had to say after the loss to the Steelers. I don't got time to wait around, you know, and it's not a personal thing. I mean, it is a personal thing, but it ain't just about me. But I mean, it's not my mentality to sit here and try to take all season to figure it out. You use these early games like this to establish our identity and we uh, we're not doing things the right way to, to establish a winning culture um, early in the season. So we got to do something to, to turn that around. He's so good, and they do. And just to be clear, this wasn't a trade request or like some like threat or anything like that, but he just, just desperately wants to win and figure things out as soon as possible. Although the winning culture comment, I mean, that's, that's a little bit of a a little jab, a little bit of a, a comment, um, a little warning shot, if you will. This has to be so tough from his perspective. We're underreacting to it. It's not like there's so much more that he can do. If you look at this, Devontae's off to an insane start to his 31-year-old season, averaging career highs and catches and yards per game. This is someone who played with Aaron Rodgers. Are you guys kidding? He's completely carrying this whole offense right now. And while he and Jimmy seem to add, like, they have a pretty good, like a pretty solid connection, let's also not forget all of this, uh, you know, the primary motivations for him to go to Vegas was that he was going to get to play with his buddy. It wasn't just a cute storyline. It really was part of the pulling uh, of the, the gravitational force of taking the best wide receiver out of Green Bay and out of Lambeau and bringing him to Allegiant Stadium in Vegas. It was Derek. And then the rug gets pulled out from under Derek. And the organization, in that swoop, Devontae's on the rug. Devontae gets sort of like, you know, he's falls, falling back into the sun. Not great. Listen, I want the Raiders to turn it around this season. I am pulling for Jimmy G. This is the home of the Super Bowl this year. Like, there's good vibes here. We want them to be competitive in the AFC West. The NFL is just a better place, and the Raiders are great. Not just good, great. And I would love to see Devontae shine there. And if this does turn into another lost season, I hope they at least consider giving him a shot to, to play somewhere else. I really do. He's in his prime. I would love to see him put these type of performances together to help a team win a Super Bowl. He deserves it. This man needs to get a ring at some point. He can't do it all by himself. And I'm not doing that would be an absolute travesty. So Raiders fans are probably going to be mad about this. And I'm not saying, like, free Devontae. I'm not doing, you know, I'm a man with a sign outside of a bar with that, okay? But, like, let's just say the Raiders, they're on high alert. They got to figure this out. I don't like hearing that from Devontae. I think it's a sad story. Okay. Uh, those are my underreactions. That's one of them. If you guys have one, hit me up at Up and Adam Show. By now, you've seen the statistics. Hey, thanks for watching. Subscribe here to get the latest Up and Adam's content right on YouTube.